Hello kids! Today, we're going to practice reading three-letter word. Are you ready? Let's begin! Let's start with short A sound. Bat Bat Sat Sat Rat Rat Mat Mat Pat Pat Hat Hat Cat Cat Fat Fat Bag Bag Nag Nag Hag Hag Tag Tag Sad Sad Lad Lad Bad Bad Pad, pad, dam, dam, ram, ram, jam, jam, ham, ham. Cap, cap, map, map, lap, lap, tap, tap, jar, jar, far. Far War War Car Car You are awesome! Next, short E sound Wet, wet, jet, jet, mat, mat, net, net, leg. Leg, bag, peg, bag, bag, keg, keg, bed, bed. Fed, fed, red, red, wed, wed, hen, hen, den, den. 
pen pen ten ten men men now let's try to read four letter word bell bell fell fell sell sell well well tell tell next is short i sound hit Wet, wet, bit, bit, fit, fit, cat, cat, let, let. Pit, pit, sit, sit, met, met, kid, kid, head, head. Lid, lid, big, big, fig, fig, pig, pig, wig. Win, win, pin, pin, fin, fin, tin, tin, bin, bin. Let's try four letter word. Mill, mill, hill, hill, feel, feel, peel, peel. Next is short O sound. Pot, pot, hot, hot, rot, rot, caught, caught, mop. Mop, hop, hop, top, top, hog, hog, log, log, dog. Dog, jog, jog. Doll, doll. Roll, roll. Next 
Next is short U sound. Sun. Sun. Fun. Fun. Run. Run. Bun. Bun. Bug. Bug. Jog. Jog. Hog. Hog. Tug. Tug. Hot. Hot. Not. Not. Cut. Cut. Mud. Mud. Bud. Bud. You are awesome. Learn to read phrases. What is a phrase? A phrase is a group of words that work together to make meaning, but it is not a complete sentence. For example, the cat sat on a mat. This is a sentence. The cat is a phrase. On a mat is also a phrase. More examples of phrases. The bat. The ant. The tree. The book. A balloon. A bag. A pen, a hat, a house, a plant, an airplane, an egg, an apple, an Indian, my doll. My bicycle, my pencil, my friend, my shoes, my pets, my cell phone, my snack, my mother, my teacher. The trees, the animals, the children, the bees, the big apple, the sweet mango, a pretty flower. A kind man, 
in the park. In the school. In the mall. In the beach. In the hospital. In the classroom. In the church. Girl eats. Boy slips. High jump. Nice works. Cute pet. Mad lion. Long neck. Big elephant. White teeth. Teaches well. Funny dance. Over the rainbow. Under the sea. Above the tree. Across the bridge. Below the table. Playing volleyball. Playing chess. Playing basketball. Playing football. Playing table tennis. See you in the next video. Goodbye. Develop your reading skills with phrases. What is a phrase? Phrase is a group of words that work together to make meaning, but it is not a complete sentence. For example, the bat is fat. This is a sentence. If you take the bat from this sentence, the bat will be a phrase. Is fat? is also a phrase. More examples of phrases. The bird, the fish, the doctor, the farmer, a butterfly, a fairy, A storm, a sailboat. My father, my mother. A cute koala, a noisy wolf. A fast car, a slow turtle. The tall buildings. The icy mountains. The crying baby. The frying pan. A growing plant. A praying child. Cooking mom. Working dad. Day and night. Sun and moon, cat and mouse, spoon and fork, 
An open book. An open box. Dirty room. Neat bed. Singing bird. Happy children. See you in the next video. Goodbye. A cat on the mat. These are phrases. Increase your reading skills with phrases. What is a phrase? A phrase is a group of words that work together to make meaning, but it is not a complete sentence. Example, a hand. In a pen. A hand in a pen. A man. In a van. A man in a van. The bad lad. Cap on the can. Bag has a tug. Rat on a rag. A rat and a bat. A map and a fan. A can and a jam. A pad and a pen. Ram and tan. A yak on a car. Sam ran. See you in the next video. Goodbye. Practice reading sentences. Are you ready, kids? The sun is hot. The sun is hot. Can you read a map? Can you read a map? Flowers are everywhere. Flowers are everywhere. The pig is pink. The pig is pink. The hog is on the log. 
the hog is on the log. Here the bell rings. Here the bell rings. The fish has a fin. The fish has a fin. My father is a vendor. My father is a vendor. Give me a hug. Give me a hug. The fire is hot. The fire is hot. We love to play. We love to play. Have you seen a windmill? Have you seen a windmill? The boy is sad. The boy is sad. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. It's fun to run. It's fun to run. The van is red. The van is red. The cap is blue. The cap is blue. I have a pet dog. I have a pet dog. Let's pull together. Let's pull together. The hut is small. The hut is small. You are awesome. Hello kids! Today, we're going to practice reading sentences. Are you ready? I can bake some cookies. I can bake some cookies. It's your turn. Are you afraid of the crocodile? Are you afraid of the crocodile? Your turn! We love to go sailing. We love to go sailing. Your turn! Did you mail the letter? Did you mail 
the letter is J. The pail is yellow. The pail is yellow. Oh, I am late now. Oh, I am late now. Your turn. Wow, I have so many toys. Wow, I have so many toys. Your turn. Have you ride in the helicopter? Have you ride in the helicopter? Your turn. Use your slippers when you go outside. Use your slippers when you go outside. Your turn. It's so dark inside the cave. It's so dark inside the cave. Your turn. I save some coins in my piggy bank. I save some coins in my piggy bank. Your turn. You are awesome. Hello kids! Today we're going to practice reading sentences. Are you ready? Let's begin! We're going to read about interrogative or asking sentences. What is an interrogative or asking sentence? First, it asks about something. It asks an information. And it begins with a capital letter and ends with a question mark, like this. Remember, interrogative or asking sentence ends with a question mark. Let's have some examples. Did you eat your breakfast? Did you eat your breakfast? It's your turn to read. Good job! This is an example of interrogative or asking sentence because it asks an information. It begins with capital letter and ends with a question mark. When is your birthday? When is your birthday? It's your turn. Where are you going? Where are you going? Your turn. Mm -hmm. 
Do you love to eat watermelon? Do you love to eat watermelon? Your turn. Let's read more. Who is your teacher? Who is your teacher? Your turn. When does school start? When does school start? Your turn. What is your question? What is your question? It's your turn. Is that your big pencil? Is that your big pencil? Your turn. Who is your friend? Who is your friend? Your turn. Is it going to rain? Is it going to rain? Your turn. Have you seen a rainbow? Have you seen a rainbow? Your turn. How do you make a kite? How do you make a kite? Your turn. Now, let's learn about another kind of sentences. Declarative or telling sentences. What is declarative or telling sentence? First, it tells about something. It gives an information. And it begins with a capital letter and ends with a period like this. For example, Today is my birthday. Today is my birthday. It's your turn to read. Good job! This kind of sentence is declarative or telling sentence because it gives an information. It begins with capital letter and ends with a period. Mio eats his breakfast. Mio eats his breakfast. It's your turn. Good job! We are going to school. We are going to school. Your turn. Let's read more. I love to eat watermelon. I love to eat watermelon. It's your turn. Good job! I like to ask a question. I like to ask a question. Your turn.
Miss Lin is a kind teacher. Miss Lin is a kind teacher. Your turn. This is my big pencil. This is my big pencil. It's your turn. Roy is my best friend. Roy is my best friend. Your turn. I think it's going to rain. I think it's going to rain. Your turn. I see a rainbow. I see a rainbow. It's your turn. I know how to make a kite. I know how to make a kite. Your turn. Now try to do this activity. Identify if it is asking or telling sentence. I will read my book. Your answer is telling sentence. Good job. Why are you crying? Asking sentence. Is it your bag? Asking sentence. She is my mother. Telling sentence. The boy is sad. Telling sentence. You're